Hello there, I'm AJ Puzzleforage, and welcome back to X4 Foundations in the Cradle of Humanity expansion, where, as you can see, we are still building the station over in Hatikva's Choice. And, as such, we are also facing the mass of Xenon that are gathering around the place. Oh, dear. Uh, so, yeah, let's get actually destroying these things before they get a chance to cause a massive problem. Although there is a lot of uh, ships that are joining in on this uh, little bit of uh, activity. Because obviously the Argon and the Terrans are very keen on getting rid of these Xenon just like I am. Are you going to manage to get that thing before I do? You are, aren't you? Are you? Yes. Ooh, lots of drops. Lovely. Okay, give me those drops. I don't care about the Xenon as much as I do the drops. <laughs> Okay. Oh, another Xenon is dead. Brilliant. Have they dropped anything good? Look at all of the missiles around the place. Okay, I just went straight past those drops, didn't I? Interesting that the Xenon are using um. counter measures for the uh, for the missiles as well as uh, as the Argon would, if if they were being shot by missiles. I don't think that the Xenon actually use missiles, which is interesting. You would have thought that the Xenon would have used missiles. I think they used to use destructor missiles in previous games. So why they're not using missiles at all, I don't know. Because you would have thought that uh, if you're using uh, disruptor missiles in one game, surely you're using disruptor missiles in another. But uh, clearly not the case. With our Xenon's not bothering to do that. Okay. I mean, the Kach have... Um, the Kach had needle missiles as well. And I don't think I've ever been shot with a needle missile with the Kach. I just, I think that they just lead me. So, that's that. E. Oh, dear. Are they doing something else? Are they all just going through the gate? Why would they do that? It feels like the Xenon are preparing a massive invasion because every single thing that we see that goes through this area seems to, seems to go through this area, which is uh, bizarre because you would have thought that it would have been uh, actually staying here and fighting as that P disappeared. No, I can see it on the minimap. Weird. It just decided to go off my uh, off my targeting for no reason at all. Oh, well done, Tokyo. You wiped Tokyo. it out. Brilliant. Okay. Now then, that leaves us with very few, very few Xenon remaining now, which is excellent. Um. I really could do with gathering a bunch of small ships myself because they seem to do a grand job. I mean, all of these. Uh, Argon and Terran ships working together. Brilliant. I don't know what happens if uh, the Terran or the Argon accidentally shoot each other. Because they already hate each other. So, you know. What happens then? Alright. Dead. Awesome. There's another couple of P over here. Interesting. P. You're just going straight through? You're just going straight through, aren't you? Ah, another bunch just going straight through. Are they going to get stopped? No, are they going to go straight through? That Asaka's... No, not Asaka. That's uh, Tokyo's giving them a good go. I don't know. I think they're going to make it. I think he's going to make it. Unless we can stop it. Hey, you! Stop where you are. I tell you. Or, well, when I say stop where you are, I mean in pieces. <laughs> ah, we are within range. Brilliant! Okay, give me all of those drops, please. And make them good ones. I don't want the rubbish drops. You give me so many rubbish drops. There should be another one on its way. Where is it? It's been blown to pieces! Mm. Well, I'm so pleased that they're actually working hard to uh, to, to secure my station. Uh, to actually earn that uh, six million. That's really cool. Alright, I do actually need to swap some captains around on various ships because it was suggested to me by Shijin uh, that uh, these miners have captains on them that are good. They are they are good at flying. At least I think they are. Wait a minute. Let's, uh, let's see. Combined skill 2. Give me more details, would you? Uh, okay, so we have... Is that a captain? No, surely not. No, that's engineering. Okay, so that's a that's a that's a good engineer on the ship. 
Which is strange, because you wouldn't have thought that it would. Anyway, we've got a pilot that's got 1.1 star. So that's a better pilot for uh, for um, the... There's another one, 1.1 star. These, these pilots are getting good. Uh, and really, we want them on capital ships. Because then, the capital ships will be sensible instead of being dumb. So, yeah, we want them on the capital ships. So really, we need a ship that's got, like, nothing on it. Which is another thing that uh, Chijin suggested. Uh, to put our selection of good captains on. Okay, we have the Odesaka here, which has no sense whatsoever. It's as dumb as you can get. Uh, so we've only got one person on here. Brilliant. So let's name this Osaka something else so that we can actually uh, identify it really easily. Uh, let's call it the uh, the dumb Osaka. There we go. So the, the dumb Osaka is the one that we're going to stick all of the people on. Uh, and we're going to take this pilot from here. Can I take the pilot from here? Yes, brilliant. Work somewhere else for me, would you? I want you to work on the dumb Osaka. There, there we go. So we'll select the dumb Osaka. Uh, and we'll have you as a captain. Of course, I'm hoping that the captain on the Osaka, the dumb Osaka, is already dumb. Was that a dumb, a dumb captain? How am I supposed to know? And then you, yeah, you're just engineers. They're just engineers. They have virtually no uh, no knowledge of captaining at all. So the new captain is super smart in comparison to the previous dumb captain. Right. So the captain for this. Hang on, wait a minute. If that's that's done, that so promote somebody else to captain. You can be promoted to captain. Well done. You now. Have, oh, you already have a piloting of one. Interesting. I don't know how you managed to get that. Maybe you just had it naturally. No idea. Anyway, we have another another good pilot here. So this pilot can work somewhere else. It can work on the dumb Osaka again. Uh, and then we'll have that as a crew member for now. Service crew, please. Great. Uh, because then we've, we've got uh, somebody else to replace a captain on another ship. I don't actually know what the captain... Oh, right. Uh, first of all, before I do that, I will assign a new captain to that ship. Great. Uh, so that can continue its job. Uh, the Dumasaka's not got a captain. Why is it not got a captain? Oh, I know, because it's uh, it's waiting for that other captain to arrive. That's fine. Uh, let's see. This has no skill whatsoever, and this has no skill whatsoever. So I can replace these captains, I guess, when the Dumasaka actually has captain set up. Now, where are all of the... Oh, wow, we have a lot of drills. How are all of their captains? Piloting 2, piloting 2, piloting 1. Piloting 2! Okay, so I will I will move the pilots off these ships and move them onto the, dumb, the Dumasaka so that I can select them for reassignment to the various um, capital ships because mostly... Oh, wait, this captain's got... A, Piloting skill of three. Interesting. That's a lot bigger than I thought. But this one needs replacing. Uh, and this one is also not so bad. Interesting. I thought they were rubbish. Well, this one definitely needs replacing. And so does that one. Okay, so there's a good few that need replacing. And the uh, the drills are getting better captains on them because they're doing more work. So, yes. the uh, the this is This is a thing that we need to do. Uh, and in the meanwhile, we need to continue blasting Xenon. Hello there. What are you doing here? That's not just any Xenon. That's a Builder Xenon. Nah. Don't want Builder Xenons around, that's definite. Where are you? Where are you going? Where are you going? Wait, 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 wait. N? Nah. The N's dead immediately. Nah. <laughs> Good. And that Builder Xenon's gone. Awesome. Okay, so this little uh, this little um, massive attack on the area has already been quelled, which is uh, exactly what we wanted. We've got our, uh, our courier vanguard delivering something that we needed to build the station super fast. So let's get that station building. And whilst we're at it, what else can we do? <laughs> they don't just like sitting here. I suppose I could leave this area because if the if 
the the Argon and the Terrans are actually defending this area really super well, which is is not what I expected. I expected to have to fight for this station to be built, but uh, with so many Argon and Terrans around, I think that we're all right with this, aren't we? As such, we could actually get on with one of these other missions that I've got. Now, where are they? Uh, this one's in Argon Prime, so let's set that one to active. Let's go over there uh, and uh, and start doing a, a, a mission that will get us a few more credits. Not tons of credits, but a few more credits. I think it's 400,000, uh, and mostly it's the rep that I need so that I can actually Im improve rep with the Argon and get further on. Okay, so we will go over there and we will destroy some car. I do like destroying car. Okay, hello there. I'm going to leave you because there's plenty of people here. You watch, I'll probably vastly regret this in no time at all. Oh, there's a massive, a mass of them again now. What? What? <laughs> what are the split doing here? Something hit us. Did it? This is the fallen families. Why are the fallen families attacking this place? You! No glory in this! No, you're right. You're gonna die. You're gonna die, fallen families. Die. Okay. Ooh, look, there's loads of drops. Yeah. That's weird. Why did the fallen families decide to suddenly turn up here? Ah, maybe they're connected to the Xenon. Maybe. I don't know. Probably not. Uh. An asp! Hello there, asp. Well, I kind of wouldn't mind getting some free ships, so, you know, if we could get one of these to to get out, then that would be brilliant. I'm not going to give up on that uh, that um, car mission, though, because I, I do want to do the car missions. I've got several... I've got about five of those car missions to, to deal with, uh, so really, I do want to deal with the car missions. Yeep! Uh -huh. Thanks for your help. No problem. Oh, of course. We're close enough to stations that they'll actually uh, appreciate us for this. Oh, heck. Thanks for your help. That is definitely not going to be one of our um, ships then, isn't it? Because I've blown it to smithereens. Hmm, never mind. There's more. M. More to go. Oh, it's an M. Okay. Is that my builder? Get away from the builder. Go away. Go away. Go away. Shoot. Go on. Get out of here. That can't be our builder. I didn't mean to hit you. Sorry. Nah, I'm used to it. Carry on. <laughs> Just try not to shoot me as much in future. Because, you know, there's a paint job on this ship. There's the default paint job on this ship. I quite like the default paint job for the uh, for the Cobra Thanks because for it's, uh, it's a nice black, sleek, sleek design. But uh, I do want more paint jobs. I've got, like, none. Because uh, due Thanks to the fact that they've turned off the ventures, all of my venture um, paint jobs just don't exist anymore. So uh, I've lost, like, 50 of one design and then loads of others. There's you know, so many, so many paint jobs that I, that I used to have that I now don't. Boo. Anyway, I think that they're going to be okay dealing with those uh, those ships. So we're going to go over here and we're going to deal with the car and uh, and, and help some poor uh, defenseless miner to get somewhere. Hopefully some poor defenseless miner that's probably got some help already. That would be nice. Ooh, a pirate mission. Nah, I'm not going to do the pirate missions at the moment. I could do, but no. Uh, because losing rep is not going to be helpful when I'm trying to make fleets for people. Uh, so, yeah, no losing rep. Hello there. What are you doing there? That's two. Two of those. Uh, the S. Um, Xenon S. Which is... Uh, there's loads of ships coming through here. Why are there so many... Why are there so many... Xenon... Small ships coming through here. I don't understand. Oh, hello. Are we defending a very large miner here? Let's have a look. Empty space. Empty space indeed. There's loads of it. Uh, let's see. Who are we defending? Who are we defending? Are we defending you? Are we defending you? We might be defending you. Yes? No? Any time now? 
I need to go a bit faster, don't I? Okay. So, who am I defending and where are the car? Am I, def I wish I was defending a big miner because that would be far easier. <laughs> well, I suppose not because big miner would obviously be uh, be um, slower than this. I think. Go in travel drive. Colossus. Go Drill. in travel Drill. drive. Vanguard. Travel drive. Think of the travel drive. It's good. It's much faster than this. Go on. I think it's much faster than this anyway. I think it goes about a thousand and something in travel drive. So that would be nice. I do love the drill design. I wish that the drill uh, was actually some sort of fighter rather than a drill. Because the drill is one of the nice, sleek designs. It really is. If we have a look at it, we should have a look at the drill. I know that you've probably seen the drill plenty of times. But I like the drill. I mean, look at the thing. It is, it is sleek. It has a very nice design. You can see that the, uh, the they could have had two guns on the front uh, quite easily. They could have even have doubled it up and put another gun, and other two guns underneath so it had four. And then the turrets at the back would have been two, so it could have been it could have been amazing. And you've got a space there where the symbol is for another two turrets or four turrets, perhaps. Haha. <laughs> but no, they wouldn't do that because that would be way too many turrets anyway. Uh, I think that the drill is one of my one of one of my um, favourite ships, even though it is absolutely useless to me, uh, other than. Um, other than for actually drilling, of course, because I have a fair amount of drills, it's uh, yeah, it's useless. So uh, yeah, I'd, I wish, I wish, I wish you could be so much better, drill. Protector. Just think of that. Think of how much better you could be. Okay. Whilst we go over there, I'm actually going to turn these on now because we appear to be in a space that's uh, relatively okay. Let's go straight for the hive guard. Go away. Because uh, why is the hive guard going over there? Why are you going over there? You're going towards all of the other. Um... Try again. Oh, fine. You know what? Forget you. Because you're not going for the drill. You're not going for who I'm protecting. You're just going for some random, uh, random argons. All right. So let's get this. Oh, I picked the the one that wasn't closest, of course. <laughs> okay. You. You. I'm going to get blasted, but not with all of that, because if I do that, I might shoot the drill, which would be uh, even worse. Die! Come on, car. I am going to blast you to bits. Please have very useful things on you, because that would be nice. I could do with getting loads of stuff for EMP bombs, actually, because... I am in vast need of EMP bombs, Protector. considering the fact that I've sold... No, I've used all of the EMP bombs to gather as many fun things as I possibly could do. Uh, and uh, so we have loads of uh, loads of station designs, but uh, we don't... Uh, we don't actually have... Uh, enough. We need more. There's always a need for more. And with more... Um, where are you going? Are you going off there again? Where are they? Why are they not going for the miner? Is my question. I mean, one forager is going for the miner, but the other one seems to be quite keen to go off and defeat the Argon. Fine. Fine. Okay, you do that. I will concentrate on my mission. Fortunately, the miner has plenty of shielding uh, and can deal with these. Can probably deal with these itself, considering the uh, the main ship's not attacking them. Okay, you. You are going to die horribly. Thank you. Now, give me that. Give me, give me, give me, give me. Come on. Have they dealt with one? No, they haven't. They haven't. Protector. Protector. Not for long. And who are you protecting? Because your you main captain right guy went off there. Which is not protecting for anything, is it? I wonder which uh, station this mine is going to. Where, whoever it's going to, it's going to be uh, helpful for uh, for our rep because, oh, I could do with some of these missions in Paranid space. If that happens, I don't know if it does. I really hope it does. 
Because I want some, I want some missions in Paranid space desperately. I need the, uh, I need the rep. Okay. Hive guard. Come on then, hive guard. You are trouble. Eep. Just a second, whilst I turn round. Okay. I will catch up with you eventually. Yeah. We have so much speed on this ship; it's brilliant. We can go very fast indeed. And you're nearly dead. You're nearly dead. Nearly. It's not going to take long if I can actually catch up with you. It's not even going all that fast. I just decided to go slow for some reason. There we go. I don't know if it's um, summoning more every time the hive guard is dead. Forager. That's possible. You'll have to do better than that. So he's going to that station over there, which is quite a long distance away. Thankfully, these uh, these. Um, car. Their weapons are rubbish. And because they're not using their missiles at all, I don't, which I don't understand, I really don't. Uh, they're not, it's not bad at all. You! Oops. I didn't mean to hit you. Oops! Yeah, oops yourself. Stop shooting me. Right. Four kilometers? Ah. Nearly, nearly, nearly. Thanks for your help. No problem! I will continue to help. And apparently, boop, uh, boop the car. That's that's that was a first. Thanks for your help. I don't think I've booped a car for ages. Okay. Protector. Protector. Where? Where is this protector? They just hang around right next to you, shooting you. Uh, unlike the the xenon, which will shoot you and then run, uh, the uh, the car will actually just sort of sit there and go, "Hi, hi, I'm shooting you now." Just enjoy the uh, bask in the laser death. Uh, where I mean, the, the, the lasers are really pathetic, but they, that's how they act. They don't they act like the Xenon, which is cool. It's nice that they've got uh, particularly different AI and actually act in a specific manner. Okay. Thanks for your help. No problem. Keep giving me cash and rep. Loads, loads of cash and rep, please. Uh oh. Hi, thanks for your help. I'll go for the hive guard rather than the forager because the forager is really easy to kill. So yeah, hive guard it is. And they're next to a station now, which is brilliant. Much more helpful for my rep. Did you use your boosters? You dumb hive guard. Okay. I know people have been telling me to use my boosters, but I think in this ship it will be a, a disaster for my uh, for my. Um, shielding. And considering how fast I can go in this ship anyway, I don't think there's any point in using boosters. You'll have to do better than that. Give me the stuff! Is it good? It's tuning, tuning stuff. Forager. Yeah. You may live to regret that. Uh, you are pathetic, Xenon. Totally. No, not Xenon. Kah! I'm so used to fighting Xenon. <laughs> Oh wow, but they do have better turning than I do. That's that's for certain. <laughs> right, you. I see you ganging up on my uh, um on my trader escort person, or the person I'm supposed to be escorting, which I'm not really. I'm just waiting for them to get to the station. That's it. <laughs> okay. Start moving. Oh, thank you. Okay. <laughs> It worked! Huh, maybe I should request that of every every one of them. <laughs> that wasn't your Queen's Guard. Yeah. Queen's Guard? No. We never see the Queen! We only see the Queen's Guard. <laughs> okay. I still think that there's there's um, proper car ships in this, other than the other than the little ones that we've been seeing. So I want to find them. I don't know if they're part of a Terran mission. I, we've still got the um, the mission to do. Wait a minute. We've still got the mission to do for the Yaki, uh, which is save them from themselves. Now I've not been doing this mission specifically because I wanted to keep the Yaki about, but um, this mission seems to be the last of the uh, the um, Terran missions that I have available. And I'm wondering, is this is not doing this mission 
slowing down our um, uh, Terran stuff. Are there more Terran missions that I'm not getting because I'm just leaving the uh, the that mission? That could be possible, and if so, then I'm missing stuff. Uh, and I, I definitely don't like missing stuff, that's for certain. Land! Land! Give me my cash! Come on! Get landed! You done? Thanks for your help. No problem! There was plenty of help to be done, and I did it. So, there we go. There's containers of Nividium stuff. Ah, there's Thanks for your uh, more help. of that. Excellent! We have our 400,000. Uh, we've, uh, we've, we've got a little bit more rep in the process. And I get to nick this from space because give me great. Okay, I wonder how our station's doing over in uh, over in uh, the next sector. Is it being attacked by tons of xenon? No, there's still plenty of argon there dealing with everything for us, so we don't have to worry about it. Awesome, and our station is um, yeah, it's nearly got a dock. I'm pretty sure that that's all that they wanted. I need to, well, not just a dock. They wanted uh, guns and stuff. But uh, we want to see if we want a... Where is it? It's this one. I want to make sure that I don't want a, 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 a defensive a defense module for this. Uh, not a defense module. Administration module. Right, okay. So do we want to... It doesn't seem to. No, it does just want the. It does just want a a dock and a load of guns. So this is set. We're fine. That's going to be no problem. As such, I shall see you in the next episode. And uh, and I need to. I need to get some rep with the Paranid, So it might be that that I'm up to. In the meanwhile, you take care. Thanks for watching. Feel free to watch other things on my channel. Feel free to subscribe if you haven't already. See you next time. Bye for now.